happy Friday guys. It is the start to another weekend vlog and I'm about to head out the door to do some errands but I wanted to show you a bookshelf first because I'm excited about it. I've been wanting to get a bookshelf for my office for a while now and I was just procrastinating. So we actually originally bought this one from Target for Jackson's nursery but it ended up just being too tall for my liking for the nursery so we ended up going with a different one for his which I'll show you later. So instead we moved this one in here and all of my books magically fit. Well most all of my books. So I just like it. It goes right underneath the frame wall and adds a little something to my office. So now I'm heading out the door. I'm like so minimal with makeup lately. I barely wear anything but I will be putting on some tonight mat and I have a date night so I'm excited and I love to dress up for those. So I want to go to Sephora to get some goodies because my friend Lindsay gave me a gift card for my birthday and I want to go to Hobby Lobby or like Michaels or something like that, whatever craft store I can find because I have a little project I've got to do. So that's the errands for today and you guys are going to come along. Let's do it. So I've had a couple people ask me on here and on Instagram how old I am. And I'm 29, in case you were curious. I think a lot of people start to get curious about age when people start to have families, um, which I get the curiosity. But yeah, I'm 29, feeling fine. Picking a liquid lipstick. Now I'm at Hobby Lobby picking up some yarn for a craft. So much yarn. I don't need this much yarn. So I'm in Jackson's nursery now and I wanted to show you guys the little shelf that I put together. So this is the six cube version of the shelf I have in my office. And it's perfect because it sits just under the window so we can still put stuff on top. And I can't wait to fill it with a couple things. So that's the newest addition to the nursery. And oh my gosh, we got this today. How freaking adorable is he? His name is Sebastian the Lamb from Cuddle and Kind. For every doll you purchase, they donate 10 meals to children in need. So it's a great cause and it's so freaking cute. And the yarn I bought today is for this pillow that Matt's mom got us. I love it, but for the color scheme of our nursery, I want to switch these little pom-pom tassel things out for black, so that's why I got the black yarn. We did get a mattress at Target as well for the crib, and my sister gave us her changing pad. We just need to get the covers in that we ordered, and what else, what else? But that is pretty much it for the update on the nursery. And I have to show you guys what I got from Sephora. Oh my gosh, this nursery has such good lighting. I love it. And this little table that you're on is the perfect height. I was going in for mainly one thing, and that was Everlasting Liquid Lipstick by Kat Von D. I love this stuff so much. And I wanted to get a new color because the colors that I have from her are like either dark or like a fun purpley color so I wanted to get more of a nude more of an everyday color I think this is one of her new nude colors called Ophelia I love the color so much but yeah it's called Ophelia and I will swatch it for you guys I'm gonna wear it on our date tonight so it's kind of like a dust the rose nude color and it's gorgeous. Another thing that I got while I was there, I kind of splurged, was the Glam Glow Glow Starter Mega Illuminating Moisturizer. That is a mouthful. And I got it in the color Nude Glow. They have Pearl Glow and Sun Glow. Sun Glow is more tan. Pearl Glow is more fair. I just wanted a moisturizer that was moisturizing and had a little bit of something something to it so this one has kind of an iridescent shimmer kind of a tint because I'm not wearing a ton of makeup these days this is perfect oh, oh my gosh I don't want to waste any of it there's some on this lid and I don't want to waste it I'll just put it on the back of my hand so you guys can kind of see 
what I'm talking about. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. It's not like thick either. It's almost like a gel-ish formula. It's just really pretty. And then I got the Urban Decay Makeup Prep Rehab. Did I say that right? My lips are really, really dry a lot of the time, so liquid lipsticks and my lips don't always go together very well. So I saw this, it looks like this, and the sample at the store was so freaking moisturizing. And I think the smell alone sold me. So it's shea butter, coconut oil. Oh, it's like you're on the beach. It's amazing. Mm. Oh, it tastes good. Cause I didn't taste the sample at the store cause I felt like that would be weird. And oh, they gave me a birthday gift because it is my birthday month still. Thankfully I went in like just as April was ending. And it is the Tarte Blush and Creamy Matte Lip Paint. So I'm gonna start on my yarn project. Charlie's gonna help me. You gonna help me with my yarn project? I just cut the little tassels off and there's a tiny little hole to string through the new ones. So I think you just cut the yarn all in the same length and then tie it at the bottom like a little ponytail. So I just finished sewing the little tassels on the pillow and I love the way that it turned out. That was so easy to swap out. I have the new lip color on. It looks really pretty. Do you like it? It doesn't come off so I can kiss you. But anywho, we are going to go eat at Gino's East. It's a uh, Chicago, oh my gosh, it's so windy. Chicago deep dish pizza place and they just opened this past week so it's probably gonna be a bit of a wait that's okay because I'm not like super starving just yet Is it time for breakfast? Is it time for breakfast? <laughs> Come on! Let's get some breakfast! <laughs> Matt's getting ready for the Rangers game. This is his typical attire. Blue on blue on blue. Get over it. <laughs> At least he's wearing my man's jersey. So unfortunately, the Rangers just lost, but they still have time to make it up in the playoffs, but that was very stressful. My throat hurts. We're grilling up some chicken Ooh. for our taco night. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. Get him, Charlie. I just cooked up some tortillas and my I didn't really cook them. I just warmed them up on the pan But this looks delicious And that is our dinner We're watching a lifetime movie about a crazy nanny a man nanny good morning It is time to go ride my bike to get some donuts and a nice coffee I'm excited because it's so nice out and I haven't rode my bike in so long. Just got home from Dunkin' Donuts. I got the chocolate pretzel donut. I've never tried it before. And an iced coffee. It was so nice out. And then I got some donuts for my sister and Matt. So my sister's coming over soon. We're going to go to Baby's R Us so we can see kind of like what all we need for baby with a mom who knows her stuff. So we're gonna go see like 
if we're gonna register, just like stuff that we need because we do have a lot of stuff already. So that is the plan for today. I'm excited. I think I'm gonna be a little bit less overwhelmed with my sister there. So it's gonna be good. Matt and I have no idea where to start on some things. <laughs> We're home from going to Babies R Us and putting a list of all the things we need together. I guess a registry, um, but oh my gosh, that was overwhelming. If my sister hadn't gone, we would have been so lost. There's just things that we had no idea we needed. So thank you to my sister. We appreciate it very much. And I'm gonna relax. We just made some sandwiches downstairs and it's time to just enjoy the rest of the Sunday. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and I'll see you in the next video.